Thank you, Ed. Now, to discuss the importance of Japan and LA County links, as well as a presentation of a scroll, it's my honor to introduce the Los Angeles Supervisor for the 5th District, the Honorable Michael D. Antonovich. Thank you very much, and thank you for the opportunity to be with you today. Let me, as you all know, Los Angeles County, which has about 10.4 million people and 88 cities, and those communities that don't have a city, they measure about uh, 134 communities of about one to one and a half million people. Uh, it's a very unique area because if we were a, a separate nation, the county of Los Angeles would have the 17th largest economy in the world and our population uh, would be equivalent to the ninth largest state in the United States. And as a result, uh, our $22.5 billion budget is a strong economic factor in our state and nation's economy. Uh, we would be the third largest manufacturing state in the union, only behind California and Texas. Uh, as I said, we are the largest manufacturing center in the nation based on employment. And one reason for economic strength is the vision and energy that our entrepreneurs, business people, and workers from around the world have been able to contribute to our county. Our relationship with Japan has been very vital uh, and our, with uh, a great relationship over the years. Japan is the largest source of foreign investment in California, and nearly half of all Japanese companies in California are located within Los Angeles County today. One fourth of all U.S. exports to Japan Come from, Los, come from California and through our ports in Long Beach and Los Angeles and San Pedro. Jurist tour, Japanese tours are an integral component of our county's economy, and this past uh, year, 2007, over 300,000 Japanese tours visited our county. I had the opportunity of serving on a commission established, initiated by President Ronald Reagan and at the time Prime Minister Nakasone, <coughs> And advisory commission which helped pave the way for a lot of the reforms in the W2O and tearing down trade barriers and eliminating the barriers and initiating free trade policies which have been a hallmark of our economic prosperity. Our county is uh, blessed uh, to have many talented individuals of Japanese ancestry providing crucial leadership and talent, providing quality medical, professional, and educational and business experience. In our county of Los Angeles, uh, we are very fortunate to have three leaders of Japanese ancestry in high-level positions. First, our chief officer, chief information officer, uh, uh, chief administrative officer for the county of Los Angeles is Bill Fujioka. His brother serves as the presiding judge in the juvenile court. Our executive officer is uh, Sachi Hame, and our Janice uh, Fukai is the county's alternate public defender. The county's relationship, as was stated, is not a new one because back 100 years ago, you established a wonderful organization on February 21st, and that was with the founding of the Japan American Society of Southern California. And for 100 years, the society has been contributing to making close relationships to the two, between the two countries. For 100 years, the society has promoted mutual understanding to strengthen economic, cultural, and governmental relationships between our two nations. And our motion before the Board of Supervisors, which was approved and will be presented on February 21st, will declare Japan American Friendship Day throughout our county of Los Angeles. So it's been a great uh, opportunity to serve as a supervisor for the past 28 years at the Hall of Administration, but also to be able to work closely with our distinguished consul generals. And you've had an opportunity of having men of exceptionally professional leadership who not just provide leadership to you, uh, those of you who are from Japan, but also to the county's constant board. Because our protocol office, we have over 90 consul generals here in Los Angeles County. We are the third largest nation or uh, municipality that has the largest number of consul generals. The other two are Hong Kong and New York. And these men and women provide a vital link. They work very closely with our sheriff's department and with our county officials. We help them when they have various issues that we can assist them with. And we have an association that they are active members with. 
And as a result, uh, we've had very close relations with Japan and look forward to continuing that relationship because our two countries' interests are best served when we work together as mutual <coughs> friends and as great uh, leaders of the two nations so that we'll have a, a better world, a more peaceful world. So thank you very much. And I'll give you this proclamation, but we're going to take it back so we can give it to you again on February 21st. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 